2023 NCAA Division III Softball National Championship. We are here with Salisbury after they are victorious in game number 13 of the tournament, 7-2 over Barry. We are with Shanna, Savannah Sheets, pardon me, on the left, Coach Lacey Lord, then Nat Natalie Paoli and Lauren Myers on the far right. Coach, we'll get your initial thoughts. Well, for once, I might be speechless. Um, I, I just think, and I'm probably going to get choked up here because I just love these young women so much. And, um, you know, I know going into to Maddie Ludnam and even Maddie, Le Maddie Lemon's last at bat in that, in that um, inning, I said, you know, you know this is going to be it. And so do, do your job up there and, and let's get this thing done. And it just, you know, I don't know why it took us seven innings, but good gracious. Um, oh, I'm, I'm just speechless. I mean, what, what, the, we're never out of a game. And that's just the bottom line. And I think that, um, and we believe that. I think even in the moment where it was like, oh my gosh, this might be impossible, but nothing is impossible with this team. They're just a fabulous group of young women, and I just love every single one of them. And I'm so daggone proud of them right now. Any of the players can answer this one. What was the thought process? What was going on in the dugout? Especially when there's two outs and, I mean, well, everything's I, on the line. I can answer. Um, like, I was walking out to shortstop in the top of the fifth inning, and I saw the sun setting behind the clouds, and I was like, all right, Coach Margie, what you got for us? And she always taught us just to never go up, and we didn't. When you look at, I mean, just how this game progressed, and Lauren or Savannah, you can jump in on this, just how it progressed, and was there – was there any doubt in your mind that that, that, that was going to happen? No. <laughs> I had no doubts. Um, we went down 2 nothing in the first inning, and I turned to a few of my teammates, and, I'm like, and I, sa I said to them word for word, I have no doubts that we were going to come back and win that game. And we never gave up, and we showed grit, and <laughs> we won it. <laughs> All season we played for each other, yeah. and that's what it came down to today. Like, the bat might be in somebody's hands, but she's doing it for the 25 other 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 of us. <laughs> I said to them too in the bottom of the seventh inning going into it, I said, you know, you've been shut out one time this season. One single time. You're not getting shut out this game. We're putting some runs on the board. And then they did it. <laughs> <laughs> you look at S Savannah, I'll let you answer this one. Just you you come back, you tie the game, take force it into extra innings. What's I mean there's a there's a good chance you could have hit your high right there, but you guys continued on. What was kind of your mindset going into that final final in, inning of play? Um, well, we tied it up, and there was a lot of emotions. Um, there was <laughs> me, one of them. Um, she looked over at me and said, get it together, because you got to go back out there. And I think we all just like looked at each other and said, stay within ourselves, um, not to push, because that's been a big thing, not to press or push and to play our game. And I knew if we went out there and I just gave the batter some balls to hit, ground balls, my fielders would work. And, so we did, and Margie was with us. <laughs> um, any of the four of you could answer this. Just you've had target on your back majority of this season. I mean, number one team in the nation for a majority of this season, and to have it come down to two outs, bases loaded, last half inning, to be able to come over overcome that. What's going through your mind as as you get a day off tomorrow and and head to the championship series? It's another day of softball. We love playing with each other. We love being around each other, and it's another day that we can hang out. So yeah, yeah another day with each other. other. We're gonna hang out and relax tomorrow. <laughs> yep. Do you think some of the magic for the comeback was in the pineapple hat, or? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, our dugout's been great all year. Yeah. Without their voices, yeah. like they charge our defense when we're in the field, and our batters up at bat. So, I mean, as crazy as we look, <laughs> yeah, we have great energy yeah. all the time. We just have fun. Yeah. Something new always comes up. Yeah. I mean, this since being here, we've now taken to making things out of cups, and we have a little yeah. headset. And the other day, I had it on, and we got scored a bunch of runs. And somebody sent me a picture and was like, "Oh, I like that." And I was like, "Whatever it takes." And they found me today. They said, "Put it on. You have to put it on." And I put it on. Coach, you get a day off tomorrow. Yes. Um, from playing. Yeah. What's going through your mind uh, heading into? the championship series with a day off and how do you prepare your team after what is a very emotional victory? 
Well, I think tomorrow, you know, I think t for tonight we're going to just enjoy this win. And then tomorrow we're going to relax and reset and, and we'll come together and we'll talk and we'll refocus. Um, you know, uh, Tuesday will be a new day and a new team and a new game. And now it's, you know, clean slate and we got to still play one pitch at a time. And that's still going to be our mentality going into it. And, um, I mean, I just think that – we're never out of it, and so we're we're just gonna reset, refocus, recharge. You know, I mean, it's hard to come back. We've only been used to playing one game, and then today I told them in between games, let's eat, and I want you to go just rest your eyes for 20 minutes and come back and be ready to go. And I think we were, and you know, it just, uh, you know, that first inning they came out really on fire, and um, and we just couldn't seem to figure it out. But going into going into the championship series, you know, we'll just get our game plan together, which is going to be continue to play Salisbury softball. Well, congratulations on the victory. Good luck on Tuesday, and we will see you then. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Go Gulls. Go Gulls.